hey loves welcome back to my channel welcome back to our all new video so today we are going to be unboxing my love me hair um i brought this glueless lace front unit from love me ombre my first time ever getting ombre um so yeah let's go ahead and unbox this i did open it up yesterday is why i had my scissors in there because your girl had to see what her new wig looked like okay um but let's go ahead and get into this unboxing comes with a band um, as we can see, it comes with the comb, the, we call it rat tail comb. It comes with the edge brush with a little sully at the end. And then it also comes with the book. I think that's on like how you wash it, how you maintain it. Um, and then it comes with the wig cap in there. I think it came with two, if I'm not mistaken. And then it comes with instructions for that specific unit and all that stuff. So this is me just taking the net off of it and all that stuff i'm going to comb it probably put some water in it put some mousse in it but so far it's very soft it's very nice minimal shedding um and i did go ahead and cut the lace yesterday um to my liking but so far everything else with the wig came already together and yeah let's go ahead and play with this wig okay Ooh, child. Lord have mercy. Girl, her put it on. Hurry up. Oh, it's a hole in it. Okay, let's grab another one, child. Grab another one. Okay, I don't think this one has. Okay, yeah, that's the other one. Okay, so it came with two um, wig caps already, which was very helpful because I did not have a wig cap already. So, all right, y'all. So now I'm going in with my edge control, my braid formula edge control. Y'all, I live by this formula, um, by this gel. I'm sorry. If I have doing my mini twist, if I'm doing braids, if I'm doing Matthews hair, whatever, I live by that gel okay i think that's the only gel that i've been able to find that will hold down my negro edges okay the only thing um so yeah i'm just brushing that gel on there that i'm going to just kind of reapply my cap forward i'm just kind of smooth out oh bless you girl bless you again just to smooth oh, bless you again all right now that's enough I'm trying to do a voice over here uh, don't sneeze no more now okay um, yes, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and pull that forward. All right, so now I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty foundation, you guys. I could not find my, um, is it Black Opal or Black Opal? It's some type of foundation that I have, like a powder that I get from like the dollar store. And it works really good. I think it's Black Opal, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but I didn't have it. So your girl had to make do with this. Now, this is my first time really installing a wig wig, like a good quality wig, okay? So bear with me. I am no professional. Um, but I see all the other girlies kind of use the powder and do their cap. And then after that, they will go in and they'll do the actual wig part. Um, so yeah, this is me just about to go ahead and apply it on just to make sure I'm liking it and it looks good to me. Um, and showing you guys the band it comes with two combs so we're going to go ahead and apply this on and then we're going to take it back off and um put the makeup on the actual lace front that it's supposed to be on so yeah oh lord I look like tina turner okay so once the wig is on i'm going to go ahead and just play around with it comb it out comb the hair out um kind of just pulling all the little hairs from my forehead because i'm i can't have like when i see like the little hairs across my forehead it makes me feel like something's like crawling on me or something's tickling me so i have to make sure that i comb the hair all the way out um now you guys can see my comb is going right through it like literally right through it there's no clunking there's no breakage like it's literally going right through it um, so now I have taken it off and I'm going to do the same thing that I did to my wig cap. I'm just going to apply a little bit of my foundation. I do not know what my powder, powder is, y'all. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and apply that on the lace front. Just a little bit, not too much, just to make sure I blend it in with my skin tone so that the lace front is just not so vague. It's more um, evident that, you know, it just looks more natural, more real with my foundation color um on the wig so gonna go ahead and do that and i'll probably go ahead and put it back on my head swoop it on in there one more time girl and that band really did help i think i only used the combs like afterwards um just like go ahead and put it on there but when i took it off after the video and i just put it back like just threw it on my head i really didn't need the combs y'all so just with this band alone um i'm able to just put my wig on and it's secure by the way, this is not sponsored, okay? Your girl went on lovemehair.com 
lovemehairofficial.com and bought her own hair um if you guys are interested in this particular unit let me know in the comments and i'll be sure to like leave a comment or put it in the description box exactly what wig this is it was actually on sale i think it was like 141 before sale and the after sale i think i spent like I want to say I spent like 85 no excuse me that was another way I think I spent about a hundred with shipping um but it was not that expensive it was like a $50 off sale that they were having excuse Matthew in the back he's back there getting ready for um service we we're going to church a little bit early because they're having a baptism class and so I was in there trying to hurry up and do something to this wig so this is just me using my flat iron kind of just trying to bump it and to make it lay flatter i think i'll need to invest in a wax stick eventually but your girl is a new beginner in having a wig okay i know i'm gonna get my wigs off of amazon throw it on and go about my business i've been doing my mini twist for like a year now so yeah now i'm going with my mousse hoping that it will help it lay down a little bit more but honestly when i looked at the wig i believe it's supposed to be like the curtain bang just a little bit on the size um because after when i was at church like a little while later my hair kind of bumped back up it didn't look bad but you'll be able to see at the end of the video kind of how the hair it just that's how it's supposed to look like that's how the unit is you know particularly made um so yeah i'm just gonna comb through it play around with it um and yeah hopefully we should be good to go so once i finished uh, applying my wig and it was secure to my liking i was like let me go ahead and do a little bit of makeup just because i'm going to church i want to do just a little bit and i was like hmm maybe i should go ahead and record it while i'm doing it so as you guys can see i took my elf primer put it on and then i just went in with the same foundation that i just put underneath um on my wig on my lace front and i just did that this is the fenty beauty i do not know what color exactly it is i can look and see if you guys are interested this is my first really makeup tutorial if you call this a tutorial type of video be over here still shifting my wig anywho yeah i just went in and applied a little bit of foundation just you know wake myself up just a little bit because i normally don't wear makeup but i was like i'm working on self-love i'm working on me and just you know new things and so i went ahead and did a little bit of foundation now i'm just going in with a little bit of eyeshadow y'all this palette is old as my draws okay like i kid you not i have had that palette since at least 20 maybe 2019 i don't really wear makeup you guys so my palettes and stuff normally last me a good minute i couldn't even tell you the last time that i did wear makeup um so i'm just going in with a few of those neutral undertone colors nothing too too dramatic um and just applying it i don't even know where i got this from i don't know if i was gifted this that's how long it's been that's how long i've actually had this unit not this unit we're talking about the wig this is how long i've had this makeup uh eyeshadow palette so i'm just applying that on i'm going to do my eyeshadow eyeshadow i'm going to do my mascara um, and then we we're going to hit the road and go. We actually had to be to church an hour early for the baptism class. So I was really up in here rushing, trying to get this done. All right. So now I'm just applying a little bit of mascara on my lashes. I definitely want to um, invest in a few pair of like short but cute like mink lashes. Or maybe even like the individual lashes that I see the girlies doing. So yeah, yeah. We're going to have to go on the whole journey of me like makeup, lipstick colors, um, like just palettes eyeshadows lashes individual lashes me applying them and all that stuff i think i'm gonna make that like a series like finding my beauty or just something like that something fun cute and girly because yeah i need some individual lashes i want to find like a really really cute lip combo that i can do um some concealer just just all the whole night i just kind of want to put it into my routine to kind of get dolled up and dressed up you know just sometimes it doesn't take a little bit just to doll yourself up and make yourself feel pretty and just add a little bit of extra to the beautifulness that us women already have um so yeah i'm just applying a little bit more and then we'll go ahead and get about the door y'all 